Hey guys, it's Mo from DataWisp. Uh, we have a brand new feature that I'm excited to show off today. Um, we've integrated ChatGPT with DataWisp to make it easier and faster than ever uh, to find insights from data, even if you're a totally non-technical person like myself. Um, so for this demonstration, we have two data sets. One is just players and information about these players. So you'll see here there's country, birth date, email, etc. And then the second data set is this microtransactions, um, which shows a player ID, uh, the amount they spent, uh, the item, um, and a couple other things. Uh, so what we're trying to do here is we want to figure out how much money are we making by country. And to do that, you kind of have to combine these two data sets. Uh, so typically, you'd have to join these together, do an aggregate um, by dollars, and then sort it by country, and then sort it in descending order, etc. Um, with the new feature, we can just click here, get this drop down, uh, and then select the two data sets that we want to use, and then ask it in English what we want to see. So here the query would be, which is the most profitable country for my game? And click here to generate that. So it takes a second, but you'll see here, Immediately, it tells us revenue by country, China, then the US, then Germany, which is exactly what we asked it for. Um, the way that it did that is by joining these data sets and then aggregating amount USD by country uh, and then um, renaming the column to revenue and then sorting by revenue, which is what I described uh, was the process to do that. It even explains to you what it did to do that. So if you're a beginner and you haven't used DataWist before, this can actually help you learn how to use the platform. Uh, we're really excited by this because it makes it just as easy to ask DataWisp for something as it um, is to ask a data scientist. Uh, and hopefully that makes all y'all's um, data scientist lives much easier. Um, there's a lot more to come, so um, thanks for watching and stay tuned.